Hi there and welcome back to the Great Railroad, dear friends and thinkers. I think we're going on a trading journey again. We want to expand Dürrenburg. Because we have so many people, we can't assign all of them. And, uh, so yeah, that's what we need to do. And we can learn new war cries. Share the pain. If attacked, deal half of damage back to enemies for two turns. Really cool. And we can learn... Yeah, one of these. Share the pain. So, what I was looking for was the ability to like pick two times rank two, but no, you have to take rank five. So, that's good too, though. And then, uh, our ranged guy with the javelin. Do we have pierced foot? Target enemy. Minus two movement, minus 15 evasion, or break the enemy's weapon. I think that's very useful, disarming shot. Do we have here? We've got the beheading. Kill an adjacent enemy warrior, except leader. Hrodrod the Freckled. Wow. We have Theodward the White. We go for Shoppen, increase crit chance. By 25% for 3 turns and restores a broken weapon. Song for the gods. Recover up to 10 hit points. Um, both. Both really good. I think I want to use Sharpen. This time. And look at her. And she can also go for beheading. Wana of treasures. Now the question is, should we take with us as uh, the rank 5 guys seem to be max level now? Should we take other guys with us? Like Athalaka of Hammers? We could do that, right? We could... Yeah, we, let's, let's build another group so they can learn on the trading journey how to behave. We have Athalaka of Hammers. So we have Dizzy Lithi. She's our leader, and uh, she's, I think, yeah, she's a heavy. We have Athalaka. He can learn too. He is an assault. So we we want to prepare for the war against the Franks, and more people uh, with better levels might be very helpful. A Belwi. Sweet mouth. We'll take him on. Uh, we'll take him with us again. He's not at max maximum level. He has he hasn't seen enough of the war to be a very very good warrior, an elite warrior. So uh, Adelwi as a ranged. And we still have Eva Hildi. Oh my yeah, we, we should really take her along. As a support, and I believe we can go for five or six. I've forgotten how how many. I always forget that. Uh, let's have a look. So Eva Hildi would be the the way and Ah yeah, that's what I don't like about the game at all. It is... Some screens... You only get at certain situations. You cannot look up how many. So you cannot really plan. You have to go to a certain screen to plan. And this is... Unnerving. Like, if you, if you would click here on Dubenburg, why wouldn't you be able to upgrade there? Now. After that event. Like, before you go on a quest. You could also upgrade. Why not? <laughs> or at least look up what you have and what you don't. <laughs> it's so... Hmm. what is at maximum again. Uh, we've got Simoda Fire Hair with her dagger. She's a new one. And we could really go for Seward. He's also a heavy. And uh, 
Theodrada. Maybe lost. Theodrada the Slippery. She's quite cool and she also needs some morale. Well, it will be a, a different experience then. And what we want to do is we want to look at the blacksmith and see who may get what, right? Why do we why do we have you here only? Oh alright. Let's have a look. Can we have we cannot manage the equipment, I think. Here. Or can we? No. <laughs> oh, we can. Here. We've got a Frankish Sparta or a Balanced Sparta or a Visigothic Sparta. Balanced Sparta is less good. Armor sets we have. Yeah. All the armor sets are there. We're good. This guy has an axe hammer, which isn't bad. And a warrior coat. Should look if we can get some better things here. At the blacksmith. For example, we get a long warrior coat. We get a bear coat. A bear coat is very good. Would certainly be good for him. And a light bear coat. Has got. A little bit less block chance. Yeah, I think I'd, I'd like the, the bear code better. And then we've got a heavy war bow. That could be for her, right? She has a hunting bow. Look at that, that's... Theodrada the slippery and uh, the bear code. We have thick warrior coat, that's equivalent. Could go for the bear coat. And we can sell the warrior coat and the hunting bow. So we've got something still. We we'll still have the light bear coat now. Rusty hand axe. Is that better than the axe hammer? No. It's worse, actually. Hmm. A balanced bronze mace. Ooh. Well, we have, we've got the heavy oak club and the iron mace, so that's better. A balanced oak spear. Oh, he's got the, the hunting spear. That's not a good weapon, right? It's much better. So that thing... And maybe the balanced path are right? Or will we? I mean, it gives uh, slash and blunt. These are much better, so... Let's sell the balanced path out. Who has the heavy oak club? She's got the heavy oak club. Oh, right. So let's go for some, uh, should we call it team building? Yeah. We've got a little bit of silver left. That is planned as such. And we'll go on the trading journey. Oh, we can get seven warriors. Let's, let's see. So last we had was Theodrada. We can take a seventh warrior with us. We could we could take Wibbert the Gordy to have another heavy, or we could take another assault with us. I think we don't have that many assaults. Hmm. Chrodward is already at at his best. So we could also take another support with us. I mean, why not? We've got Everhildi now on the team. Could take Theodward as well. 
Yeah, Seared Wolf. But we, we will have to use Seared Wolf later on, so we'll take Simoda. Simoda Firehead. As a support. She's got a hunting knife, really? Uh, well, it's okay. We'll find something for her on the journey. So, we'll trade along the coast from Winnie Balderham to Ripper. Nice. So, we wanted to add this, our good Dizilithi. Then we'll have him. Athalaka of Hammers. And Eva Hildi, the wise head. Oh my god, I'll, I, I'll, I'll hate her. <laughs> Evelwi Smeatmouth. Uh, then uh, Sivod the Ill Ridden. And Theodrada the Slippery. Simoda fire. There we go. That's our nice wool band. Let's confirm. Let's load some goods. What do we take with us. I've I've actually noted down what we need to upgrade. So um, we don't um, give out something that we will need. Yeah, that's the other thing I don't like that much about the game. It's just you you have to always keep book. I have a an own book for this game. <laughs> an empty book that gets filled. And I'm using it for something else too, but still it is a little bit Yeah, it's old fashioned. Some some would call me and say, Hey, come on, in the old games we had to Yes. I know, I played the old games too, or at least some of them. And it was good at that time. Now you can do different things with, with a good with a good interface. <laughs> mm. Yeah, we want thralls and seeds and, and things like that. And uh, I don't know. Do I want to say much, sell, sell much more? Maybe glass. Maybe I want to take every food we have with us. Because I'm pretty unsure about the storage. Or the things that we need. I think pelts are through. Other than that. I'm pretty sure we need a lot. And we will we'll take with us the ivory. Because I think we don't need that. And the glass as well. So, let's confirm. Begin our journey to Ripa. Here we go. The trip to Ripa is long and dangerous. Saxon pirates haunt the coast. Their fellow Frisians and Danes too. Still plenty of traders brave the whale road every sailing season. Financial profits are well worth the risk. man notices the cooking fires of a hamlet, can't see any ships nearby and decide to have a closer look. Oh, this will be quick. <laughs> no, come on. Uh, we'll just cache some food before we leave. Just take a few chickens, but don't disturb the peace. Oh, here are the albatrosses. Ah, oh, now the albatross is away. Was it you know, Winnie Walderham already? Yeah, the albatross, a, an old a symbol for the for the seafarer spirit, guiding and helping the seafarers to good winds. Everything. Mm. 
Let's trade in, in Winaldum. Winivaldum. Let's see. What can we sell there? I think pelts are okay from the prices. Um, yeah, pelts are okay. That's that's about it. We can sell them. They're pretty much a universal um, currency. And we can sell food here. So 80 of our food. Glasses. Glasses are cheap here. 12 even. Wow. That's the cheapest you can you can get them. Um, ivory is also very cheap. This is more a place to buy things, right? Uh, how about the tools? The tools are actually good to sell here, so. Let's go full, full risk and sell the tools, so we can have a little profit. And then what's good to buy here is... I think cloth is okay. Let's look it up. I've got my... I made my, myself a cheat sheet, so... Uh, cloth is so-so. Oh, iron is quite good. Do we need iron, though? Yeah, we need iron, so... Let's take on. We need 20 iron. Let's take that with us. And um, ceramics. Not good to buy here. Tin is definitely good to buy. Do we need tin? Because you cannot really sell tin well. Hmm. I mean, we can take it with us. It's so cheap, we'll probably uh, be able to sell it somewhere. Then there's wood. I think we need wood. Uh, we need a lot of wood. And unfortunately, it is costly here. But maybe we'll take it anyways. Then we've got some ropes. Ropes are cheapish here. We need ropes. We need ropes. We need ropes. Buy some ropes. Cloth we don't need. We have that left. How about ceramics? Are they cheap here? They're okay. But I don't think we need them. So let's confirm this trade. We'll actually go hunting there. we go hunting there? Is that a place where we could go hunting? Yeah, here, there's the little forest. Let's go for, for a little bit of hunting. Stay overnight. This is good partridge hunting country, so you wander off to shoot some of the birds. After two missed shots, you grow frustrated and vow to hit the next one you come across. As you pass some hedges, you see some movement in the corner of your eye. We'll stay focused on the edge of the hedge in front of us. And the partridge shoot out there. Pick up the bird, you also find nest full with eggs. Wow! <laughs> what? <laughs> Is that true? Let's take all we can. Confirm. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Mm. We can sell a little bit. A little bit more. Just a little bit of food. I think it's okay for two. Get another 50. And uh, thank you for watching for now. Start the next episode soon. And continue our trading journey. Have a good time until then and happy gaming.